In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a macOS virtual machine in VMware Workstation 17. First, click on creating a virtual machine. You can do whatever you want here. I'm going to leave it the same. Click next. Choose the ISO you downloaded. Next. Now select Apple Mac OS and then choose the desired version depending on your ISO. Next. You can leave this the same or change it if you want to. Next. Next again. Or you can change it how much you want to give it. We're going to do 80. Next. And then finally click on finish. Well, not yet, because we gotta customize the hardware. First, up the memory to four gigs or more if you need it. Then click on close and then finish. Then once it detect once it's done like this, your virtual machine is ready. Now let's go ahead and launch it. Now the first time you will see the Apple logo. Now I'm going to full screen this so this way you can actually see what I'm doing. Now just wait for this to boot up. This can take a moment or two. Please wait. Okay, once you reach a screen like this, select your language and then hit continue. Now we just need to format the hard drive. First, click on Disk Utility, and then hit Continue. Click on View, and then you want to show all devices. Click on the VMware SATA hard drive, then just click on the Erase button. Now you can name this thing whatever you want, I'm just going to keep it the same, and then click on Erase. Then once it's done, click on Done. And now click on the X button and then click on install Mac OS. Click on continue. Now, if you see a screen like this right here, you want to click on OK and then you want to go into terminal, go to utilities up here, then hit on terminal or click on it. Then you need to tap the following date. So the date is currently wrong right now, so that is not the right time. Um, that is actually wrong. It is not July 8th, whatever, I guess. Let's change that, though. Do what I'm doing. So just tap on date, and then it's 10101010-2016. I think it's just 16. Then I hit enter. Then as you can see, change the date. So now close out of this, and then click on install macOS again, and then hit continue. Now this time the error won't even show up this time. Now I'll just click on continue. You have to agree to this, so click on agree. Click agree again to confirm. And then you need to select the disk we formatted, which is right here. Click that, and then click on install. Now, now, oh shoot. Now this now it's gonna begin it's shoot. Now it's going to begin it's tolling. Now you need to wait a minute until oh my god, I keep getting it wrong. Now it's now it should begin to install. Now please wait. This might take an hour or two minutes actually for me. For me it's gonna take about two minutes, so it might be longer for you, but sometimes it's not longer for me. So I will take a short trip and then come back. Then once it gets to this screen, just follow the steps to complete setting up. Select your country. Well, for example, I'm going to select United States, click continue. Choose your keyboard area. I'm going to select US, click continue. Click on don't transfer any information now. Click on continue. You can sign it if you're Apple ID if you want to, but we're not going to do that. So click and continue. Click on skip. Click on agree. Then agree again. And then now you need to create an account. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to get your face.
Then once you're done with that, click on continue. Click on continue. Then it should say set up your Mac. Please wait, this will take a moment or two. And that's it. Now we have successfully installed Mac OS High Sierra. Thanks for watching. If you want more tutorials like this, make sure to like and subscribe.